One big pancake. One big pancake. One big pancake. Okay, and now we're gonna squat down. It's spring weather, it's so lovely out, and I'm going to meet Paula and we're going to go on a walk with her dog Chelsea. <laughs> We have some exciting news about you. I didn't tell you something. I'm vegetarian. She's vegetarian! And I think that I'm vegan. In addition to like all the cruelty that's like hidden in the food industry, like, there's a lot wrong with labor practices. We're not only hurting the animals, like we're hurting people too. And it's so well hidden. Where the media doesn't talk about it's so much cheaper to not practice ethical labor production. Chiquita and Dole specifically have child laborers Do picking their bananas. I didn't know You that. know, and it's like, a banana is such a happy food. Yeah. Like, how do it's you do It's a happy food, like, guys. I love bananas. Like, how do you do something like that? You know, Forever 21, they have terrible, terrible labor practices. Just because it's cheap, that's how they can sell their clothes for so cheap. Okay. Their factories are like sweatshops. Like, people just have to start talking about it and learning about it. Okay, let's keep walking. People don't care because it's so involved and ingrained mm -hmm. in our culture. This is just how people are raised. You know, as a kid, it's like, oh, I'm eating chicken. And like, I'm saying the word. But it doesn't but it doesn't click. Yeah, I well, just, I didn't know. That's why there's euphemisms. That's why they say you're eating meat. The nutrition that you're getting from animal products is because they are fed so much grain and eat so many plants. Yeah. So you're getting the nutrition through the animal. And honestly, you save so many animals, so much water, so many grains. If everyone just thinks about this a little bit and everyone makes a slight change, eventually there will be a great change in society. If you guys want to know a lot of nutrition information, go to nutritionfacts.org. I like that website. You showed it to me. Regarding nutrition, I feel like that's super important because it's like what you put in your body. Your body mm -hmm. is all you truly have. Grow as vegans influence and inspire others. Yeah, obviously you, you're my best friend. You inspire me greatly. The less that people buy animal products and byproducts, the more that those companies will increase their vegan products. Absolutely. It's only until we make that change that we will see change in those companies. What a beautiful dog. Right. Help you build an emotional, physical, and mental balance. They don't have tunnel vision. They see what's happening around. They hear about it. They read about it. They're finding out more and more. Yeah. and then they make a difference, they make a change. My sister was telling me true yogis, they are like, they're vegetarian and vegan because they really strive for that like mental, physical, and spiritual balance. There's no way for them to achieve that without realizing that like all animals really are spiritually equal. Perfect mother, perfect day. Paula made some soup and I'm going to have in this soup, beans and spices. It was so good. It was really good. You know, I feel like I can make a compilation video of how many times <laughs> I say, it's so good, or it was so good. But it's not because you have a limited vocabulary. Right, like, just because it's thing. so good. <laughs> okay, I have to take this call. Thanks for watching the video. Paula's on a dating site. You must be nuts. <laughs>